Uh, these, these are the 40 millimeter guns. Wow. Uh, they were primarily used for truck convoys. Wow. Uh, they're they're set to fire. Uh, they they'll fire 100 rounds a minute each. 100 rounds a minute. Yep. Uh, this is what they call the booth. This is where all the sensors are, the TV, the infrared, fire control officer, uh, the electronic warfare officer, they all sit in there. They're the only ones that had heat in this airplane. The duct work goes in there, and the gunners out here, they were freezing to death. We'd get up on top and disconnect the, uh, the heat, the, the duct work that the heat goes through. And, and put it on us, then they'd get cold in there and complain and bitch and whine. <laughs> and we'd just laugh. I have a 33 year old truck back at the house with no air conditioning and no heat. Oh, yeah. And literally, I had holes rest in the floor and I would drive with the air temperature being 24. And you're talking cold, that's cold, but yeah. this is probably colder. Yeah. Uh, well, I've been on one of these things at 16 below zero. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, we were flying a mission up in Laos, and we were had some altitude to get across mountains wow. and stay away from the uh, AAA. Wow. And the navigator said the outside ambient air temperature was 16 below zero, and that's what it was in here because that door that's in the front, that's open. Yeah. Uh, this ramp is up. But that door there is locked open, and there's a guy lays right here called a scanner. He, he watched for missiles or, or aircraft artillery, anti-aircraft artillery. Mm -hmm. uh, the guy in the front window up here, he does the same thing on this side of the aircraft, and then the, uh, the flight deck crew, they do the same thing from the front around this general arc. Wow. Uh, the guy on the right, the right scanner, he, he's got this whole right side of the aircraft. Uh, the guy back here's got like 180 view, and actually he can see back under a little bit because he's hanging out this far. I mean, he, he, he's, he's got a, a harness, a parachute harness on. Uh, yeah, and he's hooked up to this cable. Wow. And it's locked to his harness, so uh, that's to keep him from falling out. Because they have fallen out. They have. Yeah, you. But they had this this cable hooked to them, and they'll they can't go very far. But the the turbulence and, and the the yeah, airstream will almost float them up under the tail of the airplane, and then then the gunners have to go and clean in. <laughs> oh my gosh. And then they had to clean out their bridges. <laughs> clean out their bridges? <laughs> Uh-oh, poopy everywhere. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's gross, but it's, it's just how it is. I've never been one of these. It's just really cool to, to be able to see the, you know, all the all the lines and just all the, you know, yeah, all the stuff. It's yeah. just it's just uh, intriguing how the, this technology w was back then. This, this is actually heating duct. Heating duct. But it wasn't really hooked up on the gunship. Mm -hmm. And they diverted it inside this booth area here. Wow. Oh, somebody's calling.